Um, like he was saying, it's your senior year, you know, does it, did it come up quick? Is this last, you know, few months really hit you hard or how's that, uh, you know, in, going in your head right now? Yeah, it's absolutely come quick. I mean, you know it is. You come in as a freshman and everyone says, man, it happens fast. Coach says it, seniors say it. Um, but it really does. It really does fly. I can't believe we're in our last half. You know, it's crazy. It really is. But we're trying to enjoy every day and make the most of it. What does it mean and what are you guys doing? Do the, does the senior class really, you know, bond together and come together and say, you know, this is it? Like, what, what do we have to do every single day in practice? Yeah, I think we have a pretty good understanding of that, uh, especially right now. We have no school going on, so we're trying to take time away from the rink to be with each other. And like I said, just enjoy the time that we have now because it's going to happen fast. And um, you said your dad played for Ferris State. Is this kind of like an interesting game to play? Has your dad said anything? What's going through your head there? Yeah, I mean, I, we've been there before, so I've got to see his uh, his picture up on the wall from whatever year he played, so that was kind of funny to see. I sent a, sent a picture to him. But, yeah, we were having dinner last night and just talking about it. And, yeah, it would be fun to be back at that rink and knowing that my dad played there is pretty special. And it's always been, you know, a tough competition between you two, you guys and the, and the Bulldogs, correct? Um, what do you think is going to be the key this weekend? Well, yeah, they have a unique rink, like Coach was saying. It's a small rink. Everything happens fast, and we just got to be prepared. We've been preparing all week for what they do, and you know, they're going to be a good test for us, so we're ready to go. You look at the going on the road here for the next two weeks. Obviously, Ferris is a tough place. Bowling Green will be a tough place. Um, you were at home last weekend. and had two you know, weekends away from home before that. It's kind of a grind. What, is there, what do you do differently or what do you do to prepare for that, um, whether individually or team-wise? Yeah, I don't think we do anything differently. You know, obviously the road, like you said, it is more of a grind, but we try to try and prepare the same way every day. And, uh, yeah, we know this weekend's going to be a grind. We know what's coming, but we try not to look too far ahead. So we're focused on this weekend against Ferris. And, uh, yeah, just preparing every day, like in practice and our workouts, just making sure our bodies are ready, our minds ready, so we're ready to go for the weekend. Take a little pride in the way you guys have played on the road. I mean, it's, it's never easy in the league. Plus, you know, the, you know, you guys don't get the matchup opportunities necessarily, um, um, which probably maybe puts more on like your line, even just because you you got to go out there and make sure that you're you're defending. What what uh, what's that been like? Yeah, absolutely. Like you said, you got to be ready to go on the road. They control the lines, so you got to be every line's got to be ready to play against their top line, their top D. Um, what was the other I forgot the beginning part <laughs> that's okay yeah. um, when you look at, when you look ahead just at the second half of the season you know you know people you know the, the cliche is like sweep at home split on the road mm. you probably want to do better than that um, just considering if you want to you know win another WCHA regular yeah. season championship and what comes with that is home ice the rest of the way yeah exactly that yeah if you want to win a championship and put yourself in a spot to have home ice you got to do all on the road so yeah the home games are important but so are the road games all right, thanks, Josh. Yeah, thank you.